Welcome to the stream. Uh, I'm gonna do a little bit of this. Who else has a completion sheet close to being done? Alternate path or... Wait, what is it? Negative? Bethany just has hush and... Okay. Bethany. I'll see if I can get it done. Okay. I can't remember if this is any good. Grilled cheese. Don't talk about grilled cheeses here. I was just gonna start the Gordon Ramsay conversation. Happens every time. I got this out of a genuine curiosity. Whoa. Okay. Interesting. I've never really seen this one in action, so... Okay, so there it is. I wonder why the other one flew around. Crap. I mean, it shoots, so... not bad. It's harder for it to get hit. Okay. But I got this because I can set it up so the boss takes a hit easy. Okay. Oh. Uh. Probably not a good idea. If I had a second piece, I would consider it, but that's just... I feel like it's going to cause more harm than good. Getting devil deals with this character is really hard. No, 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 no. It's 
gonna make me regret it, but we'll see. Okay. Uh, I'm not really sure what path I'm gonna take just yet. It's not exactly extra items, it's like if you don't like an item, you get to pick it again. From a mystery item, which... I don't know, most of the time I've had... Bad luck when it comes to the mystery item. I just don't think it's worth the hassle of the alternate path, just specifically for that. That's just my preference. Extra boss item, yeah, but... Again, hassle. I would have to feel like I have items that I'm like, yep, these are good, these are gonna carry me through that path. I just, I don't know. I'm not a fan of the alternate path. <laughs> just because it's mildly irritating, I guess, at times. I think the problem with that path is it just leans too heavily on bullet hell type enemies. I don't know. I feel like it's not varied enough. It's just like, yeah, let's make it harder by making everything a bullet hell. What's the goal? Probably just finishing Bethany. I'm not going to play this for long, I don't think. Shit. Okay, well... It's risk-reward. I, I understand that. But there's still an element of personal preference to it. I just personally don't find the reward that good to warrant me kind of getting annoyed. <laughs> Especially since it's not really guaranteed. It's kind of just like, yeah. I mean, it, it might give you a huge advantage or it could be nothing. Could also end your run if you're not ready for it. In the interest of getting completions, I just... Unless I'm going after that mark, I probably won't go that path. It's just... it... Look at it this way, if you're gonna win normal runs... One more item isn't going to make that much of a difference. Like, you're probably going to do it anyway. That's the way that I see it. But you know, to each their own, I get it. Oh, I got a str I got a strategy actually that I'm going to employ after this room. Assuming I don't die, that is. Okay. 
Ah, oh, never mind. I got sniped. Ugh. I was gonna skip an item room and go planetarium. And then drop it in there, because that is something you can do. Anyway, it doesn't matter. I just got off work, so my uh, reflexes aren't exactly... Aren't exactly perfect at the moment. I've had a bit of a long day. The replanetarium items, uh, it's not as good as you would think. I mean, it's, it's great, but it's not broken, broken. It definitely puts you in a good position. I've done it before. I have had it happen before, so I know what it's like. It was alright. It's all right. It's not bad. Pretty much the way the item works is the room you use it in, that's that's what uh, determines the item pool that it pulls the items from, so that's how you pick. Yeah, I mean, it's all right. I wouldn't say I'm having much luck here. I'll be lucky if a bell hits anything. Able, able. However you pronounce it. Uh, let's leave it for now. I want the angel room. And this is... This is a bad, bad fight. Awkward room. Okay. Let's see. Blue crown is kind of bad because I don't get to have soul hearts to protect the red hearts. If I lose one, that's it, right? <laughs> it's kind of bad. I mean, otherwise I would get it. I don't know. Oh. 
That's still two times damage. Yeah, but if I take a hit, then it's completely disabled for ages. Until I have full health again. The odds of me losing even half a heart are pretty high. Like... It's something that probably wouldn't be active at all. Because she has no soul hearts, so... I don't know, I feel like they need to slightly re rework this character, like, make it just a little less harsh when it comes to the red heart situation. Like, the easiest change I can think of is... Instead of losing the Angel Room chance at half a heart, lose it when you lose a full heart. That way there's some wiggle room, it's, it's not a fucking pain in the ass to get stuff. And later on, of course, when you take full heart damage, it's one hit then, so... Blue Crown is best on someone like Blue Baby. I mean, you still lose it after you take a hit, but it, you can get it back when you go to the next room, so... It's just, yeah, this character's cool, it's just, I think they need to, s oh, this is good. They just need to slightly rework her. She's probably one of the hardest to get devil deals on, I think, if not the hardest. Which, I mean, it's not even devil deals, it's just... Angel rooms or devil rooms in general, you can't get it if you take a single hit. And that's how it is for the entirety of the run, like... Unless you get... Um... Rotten Hearts. Which are rare. Or Bone Hearts. Which are also rare, it just doesn't... You're gonna lose it. Like, I don't know. That's why I haven't really played as her as much, it's just I find it annoying that that happens. Blue Crown is a glass cannon, pretty much. Fuck. That's so sad. That would have been really good to go with either of these, but... Okay, hang on. No, let's just do this. Okay, that's not bad. I'm not gonna commit... I can get it. I'm just trying to be careful. I think I got it. It's going to be car battery, because then we get two instances of it. Oh, that's- that's really good. Okay, that- that is a fantastic start. This is one of the stronger items.
Okay, that's fine. I mean, I gotta help. I gotta health up, so. Easy come, easy go. Um, blow him up. Oh, dude, one penny shy. May as well. I know I have to try and make hush timing, but like... With this, I should be able to do it fairly easily. I think I've exhausted all the options. Um. Shit. Accident, but that's fine. This is going to be good. Okay. <laughs> Look at my circle of heads. Beautiful thing. Now I just gotta stack the soul hearts and I'll be able to do hush easily. Wish I had crown? Not really. <laughs> it's the same issue, it's, that it's like, okay, now it's two hits instead of one. I just want more soul hearts, that's it. Stack them up before the end of the run. You know what, I'm gonna skip. Oh, that's cool. Body kind of goes weird. I mean, if I can get a planetarium, why not? Yeah, I'm gonna get Hush out of the way. This is the run to do it on, for sure. Ha <laughs> ha! 
Alright, I'm game. Let's make this interesting. I mean, I have damage from the bodies, so... Murder him, nah. I'm good. I do gotta somewhat explore the map, just... just cause. What? What do you mean, what? This is the build. It's two shears that are going off, so... I have two bodies attacking it, which... It just rips through most bosses. This is one of the best damage items in the game, I think. Especially if you can get multiple charges of it. Gonna dip. All right, epic. See you later, dude. Yeah, I think this one should be okay. I uh, I just want something that is on hit. Okay. Cool explosion immunity. This is great. I'm gonna make this easier. Plus it doesn't hurt to have another orbital or two. I might take the hand just so I can prepare Gup. It's honestly not a bad idea. Guppy with this setup would be really good. Don't have to stress about explosions. Uh, does that work? I don't even know. Find out. I have to traverse this whole map. Using it. Uh, 
Guppy items come out of red chests, yeah. Good shit. That's strong, yeah. That's one of the strongest combos, especially if you can keep recharging it. It just straight up murders most bosses. It's okay, don't need to worry. In the interest of time. Oh shit. Ooh. Back into the corner there. I was trying to kill them, but it didn't work. Okay, backing out. It doesn't look like this has a planetarium. Okay. Gotta keep it going. Aha. That has potential. Have I thought of a name for that guy yet? Nah, I mean, doesn't need one. I feel like the emote could just be loosely based after the streamer persona. Doesn't need to be a completely separate thing, that'd be a bit weird. Like, why does it have to be a different person? Some people have mascots. Yeah, I mean, whatever works for them. Some people are VTubers. Some people use their faces for everything. Shit, didn't mean to do that. Oh wait, no, that's fine, because I got explosion immunity. So that's actually decent. It doesn't have to. We're talking about it a while ago. I said I would think about it. Yeah. I mean, to be... Honest, I did, and I just, I can't really think of a reason to name it differently. Uh, 
I'd just be doing it for the sake of doing it. It's okay, I make up plenty of character stuff. There's plenty of uh, things that I've come up with in the past to go with the stream lore. Like, we don't need this character. Yeah, exactly. Like, look at how rich of a character Wario is here. I mean, he's an entrepreneur selling his own lube. a bunch of stuff he does. Okay, this little fella can reach. Also, with the BFF, he is quite strong. Okay, there's one gop. Really? I mean... I checked it. The horn wouldn't be bad, but I'm good. The eye, whilst a gross item, it is an incredibly useful item. Definitely one of my, my favorite items I've added. Its utility is pretty unrivaled. What's the difference between a bone heart and a regular heart? Um, so, a bone heart is a temporary health container. And the way it works is, when it is filled with red, you can take one hit. And when you take a second hit, if you don't pick up another red heart, it'll destroy the- it'll shatter the bone heart. But if you pick up another red heart, it'll just, uh, replenish, so... As long as you can keep filling it up, you'll keep it, pretty much. Which, it's useful. It also doesn't contribute to, uh... To the losing the angel room chance thing, which is pretty decent. Kill Hush with this. And win the run. I'll achieve what I want to achieve with Hush and then move on, but... As funny as that would be. Colder Bomb. Nice. Okay, more Bone Hearts. I feel like I'm heading in the direction of the end here. I am. I don't really want to do that right away. Pandora's box. I'll take it.
shit, I got seven minutes to get through this. I should be able to do it. I'll do, I'll just use bombs to brute force through. Actually, get the soul heart. That's good. More hectic bombs. Alright, we gotta move quickly. You've got to be kidding me. Um, I guess do this. Just for the damage up. Yeah, the counter is how much, I guess, equipment bars that I'm getting out of it. That's interesting, he gets the soy milk effect too. Hopefully I'm on the right track here. Nope. Back out. going. Don't have time to <laughs> worry about this. Alright, uh, we got shit. That's fucking annoying. It's like the worst thing that could have happened here. Better hope I'm right. Oh wow, I was correct. Very nice, very nice. I need to get closer. There we go. Ooh. 
two minutes left. I think we're good. Uh, okay. We're going. I'm dodging because I really want to get this done. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Uh, yep. Nice. That's a very, very good thing to have. Okay, so, hold up. All right, still not over. Call. Oh well, that works too. All right. You might be wondering what I just did. I just cut off my body multiple times. There we go. I had the spark plug, so I sacrificed multiple bits of health to run the item again. It's okay, we got this. Okay. Well, I mean... And then we complete the negative and that should do it. Then it's just alternate path that remains. I do like that you can see everything. It's pretty neat. No guppy transformation, but that's fine. But the sinus infection just should carry. Have a verb pill. Why is this so scary? I mean, 
This is meant to be satanic, this path, though. Gas, nothing worth reusing. I don't know if they've changed soy milk or what, but it seems to be better than it used to be. Or maybe I'm just having better luck with it. Oh, I'm gonna go complete the heart. Shiz is one of these items that I, I, I always have a good time with. What I did on the first floor pretty much set this up for victory. going very well. Okay, so sacrifice the friend. Nail form. Nothing really worth it. I don't think. I should probably put down the guppy trinket. Oh, sorry, the hand. Because I want normal chests now. Since they guarantee items and reds don't. It's cool that I can see on the inside. Oh, that curse of the tower is super strong. Nice. Okay. Uh, that's range down. I probably should have used that in the boss room, but eh, it's fine. I just want the rest of this run to be easy.
I uh, may as well use it here. I think all up throughout this run, I've taken one hit. Maybe. Well, maybe two or three hits, actually. If you can't hush. I haven't really taken that much damage. And that's... I mean, the Holy Mantle definitely has something to do with it, but I've also been dodging pretty well. I could have done the alternate path with it, but I figured get the one with the time constraint out of the way, because that's the more annoying one. Wait, we give heavenly entities and items arbitrary choir chords consisting of what is considered feminine pitches, and you think that's silly? I don't know. Like, you're trying to deduce logic from something. Like... I'm sure there was a reason. I mean, dude, left-handed people <laughs> were considered, like, satanic once upon a time. So, you know, had I grown up in that era, they would have forced me to use my right hand. There's, there's definitely weird shit. church, well, the cathedral music kind of reminds me of Castlevania music. Oops. That's my bad, shouldn't have done that. Alright, let's wrap it up. Nah. We move on. I've already done the loop thing. Okay, so all that's left for her is the alternate... Wait, no it's not. Oh, it's boss rush. I've done the alternate path. Fuck. It's another time constraint one. Hmm. Okay. So, 20 minutes on the board. Well, that one... The thing was... I wasn't quick enough to make it into boss rush anyway, so... Wow. <laughs> Have have some have two positive effects. Let me heal you, and then teleport you out of the room. Don't worry, you will not you will not experience danger. That was quite great. Targeted shot. All right, that's good.
it's definitely a good boss fighting item. Pretty much don't miss, and your damage increases. Damn it. It's a pretty simple item. It's an item for good for sh slow shots. If you get a rapid fire rate, it can be a little detrimental. But at the start, it is one of the better starting items. That's for sure. The Hierophant. Damn it. Take it, I guess. Empress, Hangman. Empress, Clubs. Alright. What's the grade or alternate path? But I don't need to do it with this character. I've already done it. Fuck. I was trying to be accurate and it messed me up. There's an alternate path, the watery place. Yep. Well, I mean, it's an item, I guess. It's on low cooldown, so... I guess I did get my angel room item anyway, so... It doesn't matter too much. Oh shit, freebie. Love me a freebie. Oh, I don't have a key. Uh, I can get one. I hate this room so much. Okay. Green laser. No, I got it. <laughs> got it. That was lucky. Um. Okay. Eden Soul. And we're gonna we're gonna try and do the the opiness. I can already use it technically. Almost. Because of all the soul hearts I found. Okay, skip- I'm skipping the item rooms. Yeah, I'm gonna go for the planetarium. Unless I get the angel room easily, it's probably gonna be a planetarium deal.
I could use it in here now if I wanted to, but... It... Like, I think this setup... I can't afford to skip item rooms. I'm going back real, real quick. We're doing well on time. Trying to be sensitive to time here. Uh, okay. I have to start looking from the next floor. No, this one charges on kill. So after X number of kills, it will charge your item. Get, get that on the way out, I guess. The one thing that did get disabled was the accuracy hit. It's no longer doing it, but I mean... Minor price to pay, I think. Does this affect it? Kind of. This is really good. With the toxic splash, it is it is super good. Try oh, fuck this room so hard. Stupid obnoxious room designs. We gotta be careful. If I die, I become Lazarus. We should be okay. Backing away. I'm just quickly checking. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'll skip to it most. Okay, we're done. The next item room I'm getting regardless. Okay. Oh no, my range went down on the laser shot. Oof. It's okay. I don't care about that anymore. This is something I come to terms with. This character is just, I'm probably not going to get angel rooms or devil deals. Not worth it, but whatever. Yeah, I mean, Basil Bob is definitely an option. It's just. I need two. nothing. It's okay. I'm using strength here. I want them gone quickly. Okay. I've got good time. Seven minutes. Don't use it yet, actually. Across without taking damage again. The iframes do not last as long as they used to. It didn't get rid of damage, I used the strength card. So the strength card cleared out when I left the room. That doesn't stat down. Where do I found this? Mm. 
I'm really banking on this working. Keep getting this stupid, obnoxious room. I can look for it still, there's still plenty of time. You can't use it and salt twice, the item depletes the moment you use it. There's no such thing as using it twice. It gets destroyed upon first use. It's the same as, uh, Diplo. would instantly kill her. Alright, I gotta go. I mean, it's fine. I'm just trying to achieve the goal here. Okay. Doesn't exist. Doing this for good measure. Should be able to do it, there's two minutes left. I kind of locked out here with the the type, because she's going to step in the green goo. Uh, nah, we're good. For the life of me, fly. Okay, probably fly. Because then that just leaves one more. I mean, worst comes to worst, I'll just use it in the treasure room. Yeah, I don't really have great damage here. I 
it's, at least it's lenient enough to be dropping hearts for me. I hate this boss. That's curved brimstone bullshit. Angry fly completely wrecked. Got quick monster. Fuck's sake. It's a stupid curse of darkness that's fucking me up. Go knock back, go. Plus it's not over yet. first
pretty lot. Oh, fuck! Enough with the curses! I was gonna say pretty lucky guess. Anyway, I got a completed character sheet, so... This floor can have the planetarium, you're correct. Okay, this is annoying me. Does it have gamma? No, it doesn't. Okay, that's a little easier on the eyes. I'm sorry, but this curse is annoying. <laughs> I'll just crank up the gamma. It could. It will, it might not necessarily happen. So tired of this curse, like <laughs> I mean of course because I'm trying to do this it probably won't give me a me six. Odds are it's not happening. Oh, it did. Okay. Well, there it is. Okay. Jupiter. Sol. Saturn. <laughs> I am a chunky thing with wings. This looks pretty amusing, I gotta say. Look at it. It's got a belly. Hey, a bezel bob, right? <laughs> the animation is great. Oh wow, that looks really pretty. This is really visually interesting, I like it. Let's just do this. Okay. And I get to get the items back as well, so, you know. Let's 
so pretty. I can't remember if I got the treasure room in this one. I did, okay. I am very happy with this build. I think these are the ones that I skipped. Yep. Sad bombs, nice. Oh yeah, right. They're friendly. That's like brim brimstone butt. I'll be back in a minute. I'll see if I get more money. Oh wow, they're friendly too. Even the big ones. That's kind of mental. I kind of wish they didn't blow up so soon, but... Well, because of Basil Bob. GG! Explosion immunity. And heal. Unfortunately, it killed everything. Man, this... Yes, join the horde. I might be able to find another, you never know. I mean, look, this is still pretty fucking decent, like, can't really complain. These are going to give me more flies. Oh, nice. Yes! Let me... Let me get more of that. I love the animation I have with this. I have a little booty as well. <laughs> the animation on this looks so good. Okay. Alright. Just 
I should do this more often is pause so then the seed comes up. Because I'm going to put this on YouTube later at some point. So. Or at least if anyone wants to play it, it's there. Well, I mean, look. It's looking good. I oh, in the back of my head. Oh, no, it's freeze. Alright, cool. <laughs> I just... I love the animation. It's so good. Okay. All the flies are dead. With the exception of a couple. This boss is annoying. I think this is the harder. Whoa, 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 it lost. What? Huh? Wait, what? <laughs> Hold, what? Huh? What? What? Hang on, the. What? The TV was still alive. And it lost half itself in instantly? How did that- What? Huh? Huh? <laughs> what? It's stuck. What did I do? I, I, I think I glitched it. <laughs> Glitch passive went off. Alright, cool. I, I don't know what I did. Whatever. Uh, dear. Well, that was great. Hopefully the moment thing worked. I don't know. Drive me six. I'll have to edit the clip afterwards and see if it comes up. Hopefully I wasn't too late. I remembered. Yes, now you can earn more towards the badge. Oh, right, and then... Yeah, I mean, it's the moment, Badge. It levels up. Plus, I want to see what happened. There has to be some explanation. Okay, this is the one I have to use it on. There we go. It should follow it, right? Yeah, okay. And we finish this off.
Guy me six. Go. Go me six. Go me six, Abby. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, they're still here. Well, this was a thoroughly entertaining run. I'm definitely gonna have to uh, check out what on earth happened with the, the footage. Hopefully, I wasn't too late. If not, I'll just reclip it. It's fine. Suddenly, the sky above. Okay, character complete. Ah, <sighs> feels good, man. Okay. Give me a sec. Now that I can see it. Uh, content. What? Moments. There it is. It's in moments. Just a sec. I can't see chat. Yes, it got it, it got it, it got it. Perfect. Ah, oh, I got the end of it, damn it, not all of it. Damn it. I really wish it would give you more uh, time for it. Oh well. I pressed it a little too late, like I got it at the point where he died, unfortunately. Um but you can have the you can have the clip. It's a bad clip, so I'll probably delete it. But you'll still get a uh, contribution to the badge, I believe. Yeah, see, this is this is why. At some point in the future, I will have to get like someone doing this for me because I'm just too slow. Anyway, it's okay. <laughs> Can't say I didn't try. I can make a clip from YouTube. No, I mean, I can make it through Twitch. I can, it's easy enough. It's just, it would have been nice for it to be on the moments page with the badge and everything, you know? I think Twitch needs to be more lenient with the amount of time you get for clipping. But I got why they only do it for like the last two minutes that just happened because, yeah. Anyway, uh, I mean, progression is happening. What do you need? You need alternate path. I'm just thinking who I should play as. You must have missed something cool. Oh, just my glitch passive going off. No big deal. All right, you know what? Fuck it. Wait, how does this work? Whoa. Oh, okay. What happens with this? Okay, so it slows it down quite a bit. It makes the bone bigger, so I, I guess that's cool. Do I need to do- I don't need to do- okay, so I could do the alternate path, maybe. 
since that is a massive damage up. Or I could go hush. Do a standard route. Boss rush and hush, maybe. I think I'll do that. I don't feel like doing the alternate path today. How's it going anyway, Mornola? Yeah, what happened was, um... Somehow I glitched the boss to die. And part of it remained on screen, and then the second phase of the boss started with half HP. And then it stopped attacking me. <laughs> or it got stun locked, I'm not sure. I'm gonna have to go see what happened, but... Definitely not a normal fight. Four AM can't sleep. Damn, that sucks. What is? Oh, that's one of the new items. All right, no idea what it is. The boss gave up due to my superior battle power. <laughs> nah. If I was, I've said this before, like, but if I was, like, uh, a card in one of those, like, Hearthstone or something like that. One of those card games, it would, my card would be, like, flip a coin, if heads, this attack does nothing, if tails, bend the fabric of the universe to your will. Spuder. Okay, cool. I don't think I need to bother with the, the dice room because I'm kind of happy with what I have. Wait, what? <laughs> I don't even know how you would pronounce that. What's the colloquial term or layman's term of that? It's all the colors in Magic the Gathering, got it. Just feel like I'm trying to read someone's nickname <laughs> where I can't figure out how it's pronounced. Maybe I should just have a text-to-speech where if I'm struggling to pronounce someone's name on Twitch, I'll just defer to the text-to-speech. That would be pretty funny. Wait, I don't think I've gotten the blue candle before. Wooberg, really? Okay, well. I mean, I understand it. That is definitely a get wrecked son. I was always envious of card games as a kid, because... It was something that I just couldn't have growing up. I mean, between, like, food and clothing or giving the eldest child some trading cards, I, I guess my parents couldn't. <laughs> but, you know, I always did want to get into them as a kid. I just couldn't. Oh, 
But I mean, I got the dopamine hit as an adult, so it's fine. I got my Charizard card in the end. Also, anime waifu trainer cards, which I seem to constantly get. Shadowless foil. What is shadowless foil? Sure, why not? This is a pretty good run. Okay, we'll use that to get whatever the boss is. I said I got my Charizard card, but you thought you meant the Char Charizard. No, no, no. I mean, I got a Charizard card, not the Charizard card. I'm not that lucky. Or rich, for that matter. Like, <laughs> I'm not Logan Paul or Jake Paul. Whoever the fuck opened the Pokemon cards and started the whole, hey, these things are now, like... Something uh, grown adults are going to fight over because they think it's an investment. It's absolutely mental that that was the state of things. I still have some cards that I haven't opened, but I'll... I'll save them for when I play Pokemon. They're still there. Pokemon cards have been like that long before Logan and Jake. No, they have, but... Look at, look, look at it this way. My brother works at the Australian equivalent of GameStop. There were people... walking in... pretty much trying to purchase everything, everything on the shelf. Kids couldn't get their hands on them. I mean, before it was like, sure, sometimes there'd be shortages, but this was like, straight up. Trucks were getting, <laughs> like, stalked and shit. I think someone in America lowjacked a delivery truck that was known to bring Pokemon cards to a store to know when the car deliveries were going to happen. That's just the insanity that it was going to. I mean, for me, it was just, you know, living a childhood thing that I couldn't do. The Pokemon cards I had as a kid were pretty much spares that my friends gave me. Because there were people that were assholes and were like, uh, you can't even afford $5. Like, no, just my parents don't want to buy them. Because, <laughs> you know, we're a little bit poor. It sounds like America. Good guess, it was in America. Honestly, the card that I wanted was Blastoise, because I picked Squirtle as my starter, so... I always wanted Blastoise. I have- I have still an opportunity to get one of the, uh, reprints of the originals. Like, I do have some of those... ...booster packs lying around, I just haven't opened them.
the thing is, apparently with the cards that I opened, I, the ones that I got kind of paid for what I spent on the cards, if that makes sense. If I was to sell them, I'd get my money back and then some, which is kind of a wild thing for me to think of. Interesting. I mean, like, that's making me reconsider the pad now, because... It's slow- well, it's petrification, so... Or fear. So in the boss fight, that could be useful. If the packs are old enough, won't I just make my money back? I mean, if I really wanted to, I could just not open them and hold on to them for, like, 20 years. Because they are the anniversary ones, right? But, I don't know. I, I, the reason I got them was because people enjoyed when I opened some. And so it was like, much like with any money that comes to me through Twitch, I just put it back into Twitch. Or the stream, so to speak. So, you know, that was more important to me than making money. A shield? Because I already got a sword, I guess. Oh, didn't say open then, just say I would make money. Yeah. I know. But that's... I guess that's not what's important. Listen, if I wanted to make money, I'd tell you about today's video sponsor. It would be, uh, Dollar Cock Club. You know? It's where you buy chickens for a dollar. Oh, you thought it was Dollar Penis Club. No, no, no. Dollar, dollar Cock Club. It's roosters. See, that would have been a good joke for chicken police. <laughs> Not Raid Shadow Legends, no. Listen, okay, I'm being real now. If I ever were to do a sponsorship thing in the sense of, like, I'm doing streaming for a living and these are the sort of things you have to do to make a living. Oh, Planetarium. Um, that's a 1% Planetarium as well. I would only go with something that I would personally use, have used, or believe in. I wouldn't do something like a gaming chair, for example, or like Raid Shadow Legends or NordVPN. Um, or, you know, any gaming beverage that swears that they're going to give you energy and, you know, I don't know, make you more attractive. Like, it would be something that I, I would believe in, so I'd be pretty strict about it. And I would also be like, listen guys, I know this shit is... is annoying. And it's horrible. And I get it, you don't want to hear it, but it pays the bills. So sorry. But those are, like, circumstances that probably won't happen, so we're fine. Ooh, the... Okay. That's... See... You can use that to change characters at the last second and get the victory of another character, but I think I'm fine. I'm also not, like, making fun of people that have those as, like, their sponsor. Like, you know, you do what you gotta do to... ...to earn a living, right? <sighs> Damn it. I think that's the worst one, but I grabbed it anyway. Mm. Mm. 
This is this looks pretty cool though, I gotta say. I look like uh, an undead pirate. Wait, what? Oh, spider. Where are my angel rooms? Honestly. I think this item, like the Mars item, would have would have been better as a use item. Instead of a uh, double tap, it's just too easy to accidentally double tap. It does wa remind me a little bit of the Wario charge, though. Okay, yeah, the made boss rush timing. One thing I have been curious about is how soy milk would affect this shot. Haha, <laughs> get juked. One of your friends sent you memes about the queen. Damn. I mean, there are some comedians out there that would not care and make a joke. But yeah, I mean... I don't know. Australia's part of the Commonwealth, but the queen's always been like a 50-50 a thing here. It's, it's definitely in bad taste, but some people just try to be like that constantly. It'll be interesting to see what we do here in Australia because... The discussion always was that eventually we would become a republic, it just... You know would come from from this event basically wow that shot just completely melted her. What am I doing? Um, negative? Yes. Okay, that is very good. Um, have we done Mega Satan? We have. Uh, how's the timing? Nah, let's just leave it. Razor, Curse of the Tower, bad choices. We don't have explosion immunity, so I guess that. Oh yeah, right, I can do that. I'm 
on a leash. If I can make cash time, I'll be happy. Whoa. Nice dodge. This Mars item is such a liability. <laughs> I don't know why I picked it up. Like, I should have just left it. There's, I was just like, oh, planetarium item. Of course you have to pick it up. It's a 1% planetarium. And it'll make my character look cool. Blood skeleton. It is satisfying one-shotting stuff with this. Uh-oh. that sound oh I see it was the poop what comedians do I like listening to um I mean, I like Bill Burr. That's one comedian that I've listened to recently, Ronnie Chang. I did like Norm MacDonald before he passed, but that... I feel like isn't for everyone. His style of comedy was he would often tell a story. And then, you know, just kind of detract from the story. And then eventually he'd end up with the punchline, and you wouldn't expect that, and you laugh because it's stupid. Um, in terms of Australian comedians, there's this trio called uh, Auntie Donna. They have a very good show on Netflix. If you're into, like, comedy with singing. What was his name? Norm MacDonald. I mean, you might recognize him. He was on Saturday Night Live a long time ago, and he was in Billy Madison. Just don't start with his uh, latest special, because it's a little sad. He, he did it. He filmed it like... Pretty much right before he was going in for a surgery, and then he passed away. He probably knew what was up. So it's it was done during the pandemic, and he doesn't have an audience. He's just sitting at home, and he's he's filming what would have been his last special, basically. So don't start with his latest one. Go as far back as you can with him. His best moments, I think, is when he appears on talk shows, because he just derails shit constantly. Yeah, 
feel like I'm asking for trouble by getting that. Yeah, it's sad, but, you know. The dude, uh, like, did the performance, like, as if he was in front of an audience and everything. And the guy was, uh, friends with a lot of, uh, big comedians like Dave Chappelle, Adam Sandler. How's my time? Oh, I might actually make Hush. That would be really cool if I could... Uh-oh. <laughs> it's okay, I'll just use charge to get around. Adam needs to do more stand-up. See, here's the thing about Adam Sandler. I'm not really sure if he was funny and he stopped being funny, or I found him funny because his movies were, like, pretty immature. And, you know, that was the kind of comedy that was funny to me as a kid. But, like, some of his later movies, I just- I feel like I haven't laughed as much. So I haven't quite figured out if, like, maybe... ...him being funny was just a result of me being young, or... ...he just changed his comedy style over the years. Right, his whole thing in his movies is he's the arsehole who gets the girl. Uh, I mean, not always. Like, Waterboy, um, he wasn't playing an arsehole. He was playing a kid that got bullied. In The Wedding Singer, I think he played another one of those kind of characters as well. I'd say it's about 50-50 with him. He'll play like an arsehole or he'll play a dude that uh, is made fun of. And then there's that role uh, that he did recently where... What was the name of it? I think it was like something Diamonds. But it's a crime movie. Or a crime show. No, it's a crime movie. I can't remember. But he's tried a serious role. And from what I heard, it's not bad. Uncut Gems, thank you. That's the one. That- I had the right idea. <laughs> Diamonds, gems. Same difference. It was okay. Yeah, I mean... It wasn't something super amazing, but... For someone trying to do a serious role... Um, it was alright, from what I heard. Comedians doing serious roles is not something that's done very well. The few ones I can think of, like, uh... Brian Cranston. I mean, Will Smith, say what you will, but... He started in comedy and then moved to drama, and he can still do comedy. Um, Bob Od Odenkirk, or whatever his name is, started off as sketch comedy and then plays Saul Goodman. Oh, this is this is not going well. Well, I've made hush timing, but I don't think I'm gonna win. But I'll try. I mean, 
I got nothing to lose by trying. Piera. Emperor, Emperor. Bad luck. Okay, well that worked. What? You want me to check something in Discord? But that would be detracting from the stream. How does this work? Wait, what? Whoa! Whoa, what is- holy shit, what is this? Okay, but then... What is the synergy? You don't get control shot there, but then here you do. Guess go for the slow. Interesting. I don't think I'm gonna win, but that's cool. I don't have shield. I have shield. Why didn't that? Oh. Oh, yeah, this is annoying. It was worth a try. I think, honestly, this this Mars item has fucked me up. This is the last time I'm picking it up. Fuck! It's going to be a Christmas miracle if I finish this. Trying my hardest. Good, thanks. Thanks for that dash. Well, I can't turn into ghost anymore. Yeah. Don't pick up the Mars item, it's just so shit. Like, it, it hands down, fuck this. I'm not even... It's so easy to double tap, it's not funny. Like, you try to be precise and instead you're double tapping.
Ah, uh, whatever. Uh, but, I mean, I got boss rush. So that's nice. Alright, what is it you want me to check here? Adam Sandler wants to unite his iconic characters. Okay. <laughs> See, that wasn't worth me, like, interrupting the stream. Adam Sandler universe, like, MCU style. Uh, okay. So he wants to do what Eddie, Eddie Murphy or like, uh... Who else does, like, multiple characters? Seth Myers. I think it's in order to... I mean, I guess maybe it's overthinking that, but... I don't know. I look, at, I look at it this way. I wouldn't go see... Eight different Adam Sandler movies... To go get continuity in a movie that brings it all together. <laughs> Just, nah, I'm good. Ah, oh, fuck. Damn it. Mistimed it. Uh huh. I'm low key worried that I'm gonna do a dash, but I don't have the item anymore. I don't know, maybe my standard of comedy is a little bit higher. I can already see what would happen in that movie as well. It wouldn't just be him. Like, he would get all the weird characters that Rob Schneider has played and, uh... All his friends, pretty much. They probably have Mole Cop in it. Because, of course, Kevin James has to do his characters. And, uh, Steve Buscemi. Who else usually cameos in his movies? There is an age gap. I suppose, but... My enjoyment of the Adam Sandler movies came before the age of 15. Mm. Alan Covert, Peter Dante. Okay, there, there you go. Um, Norm used to be a little bit in his movies as well. Alright, if it was on Netflix, maybe I'd watch it. Just out of interest, but... I, I honestly can't remember the last Adam Sandler movie I watched. <laughs> you ass. <laughs> Whose movies? Adam Sandler. Like... I was saying earlier that... I, I was thinking that maybe... The only reason I found Adam Sandler funny originally was because I was young. 
because I feel like his later stuff isn't funny, and it begged the question, like, was he just never funny? And I only found them amusing because, uh, you know, I was a kid. Ah, uh, what does this do to the bone? This is one of these questions that I, I'm gonna hate the answer to, isn't it? Oh, okay. Uh, hmm. No, I mean, it's gonna carry the run, it's just for what I'm trying to do. No, because that's ex like I was asking because it's explosive shots, which are a bad thing inherently, but it, it doesn't damage you, which makes sense, so at least it has that kindness. What am I trying to do here? Alternate path or... Okay. I don't think the alternate path is happening with this combo. I'd have to look at his titles and then I'd be able to figure out which was the last movie I saw. I want to say it was Big Daddy, but I'm not sure. I had my cousins watching Grown Ups and I caught a little bit of it, but not enough to, like, say that I've seen that movie. Like, I saw maybe 10, 15 minutes of it. It's almost like I have explosion immunity, but I don't want to stress test it. I just... yeah. For dodging, this is not good. You wanted to watch Uncut Gems, but that's more of a serious movie. I have heard that that's not bad. For a comedian trying to do a serious role, it's on the side of good. But I have not seen it. What is that? Cracked orb, shards of knowledge. Not a clue. Can't get that. I guess it'll either become obvious or I'll have to look it up. <laughs> Wait, what? Huh? How did that open? Ah, oh, piss off. 
maybe that's the shards of knowledge item. Oh shit. Okay, we good. Uh Alright, I'll buy it. This isn't doing nearly as much as I had hoped. Does that what? Well, okay, it does. It's a faster swing now. Not that it matters, like, I get knocked back. Okay, they do become nails. The dream here would be to get some form of explosive immunity, then I wouldn't have to worry about taking damage. Okay, it wasn't there. Uh oh. Okay, it's fine. Asshole. Uh, okay, cool. We're fine. Wait, what's- Whoa, 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 what's that? What's that red door? That's gotta be the shards of knowledge item. probably put some of this money back. Good enough. So, I'm guessing this is specifically for the red key. So this is telling me where the secret room is for the red map. Yeah, it would have to be. That's kind of neat, it's just you need two items to make use of it. See ya. Uh, I don't know what- okay. <laughs> I have one item that I don't know anything about. This one would be good because I'm melee. I'll, I'll just go with what I know. For melee, this is pretty good. Oh, and this as well, I suppose, because it's like... It's making it more intense. That's pretty good.
Okay. Ugh, castle blind. Yep, good luck. If I have to play this defensively, obviously I'm not going to win. Okay. Nord Leaf. Come on. Let that be the item that I get, and then that would mean I get win. Oh shit. Ooh, okay. Dire circumstances. I can't be in bone form. Ah, oh, damn it. Wait. Oh no. That was just unfortunate. Oh, I suppose I can do this. Come on! I think that's enough. There is a store still. Unclench. There we go. Not bad. It is it is a good item against Hush. Fuck's sake. Try to make the most of this. Okay. Oh no, it's- did that really slow me down though? range better? It might be. Yeah, okay. Less dire. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna be doing boss rush, so... Unless the item is a no-brainer. 
Yeah, okay. Just making sure. a shame. I suppose I should buy it just to get the free bombs. There we go. Seems every time I get the 50% off, the shop just doesn't really exist. See how this works now. When I took the damage, it revealed the secret. Shield again. Okay, uh, I'll check this. Uh... <laughs> I feel like... No. Well, how does it... it... I don't think it affects the swing at all. I need to look this up. Because if it gives me four swings, that's good. If it doesn't then it's, there's no point. That's fl four explosive shots. I want to see how it works. Mutant spider on the forgotten. This is what I want to see. Interactions... Let me just see. I want to see. Doesn't say anything on the wiki. Okay. It appears to have an effect. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, but like, this is super dangerous. It does work. It gives you four bones and they have their own independent shot. This also works as well. I don't want to lose health, so I'm going to stay in the swarm until I get red health. Oh, 
Oh, hello. I mean, okay, this is pretty decent. It's not nearly as dangerous as I thought it would be. I can always bitch out if I want. I get it. Oh, explosion immunity. <laughs> it was worth it. Okay. Now I don't have to worry about the shot fucking me up. Yeah, okay. Now, to, now I can just do this point blank and that's fine. It's definitely good. Now stuff gets in my face, it's all good. If only it would have been the other one that healed on... on explosion, but... oh well. This is still really good. Okay, thank you. I think this is the first time in a long time I've had this combination. This, well, at a point at which it was really useful. these things. Where are they? 
I just move too quickly? There we go. Five minutes. Okay, I think I can do it. <laughs> okay, that's pretty neat. Okay, that's huge. I might be able to restore my health before the next fight. Does the skeleton body only take damage when the ghost is inside it? Yeah, you alternate between two. It's technically two characters. Oh, you... I didn't realize they came back up. It's all good. I got it back. So with damage it reveals the map. That's an interesting effect. I mean, I'm doing rooms. I know I can skip them. I'm doing them because I want to potentially generate health. That's the only reason I'm doing the rooms. <sighs> Fuck's sake. Wait, what are we going to do now that the queen is dead? Can we get rid of the monarchy? Um, so Australia had a referendum in the 90s to become a republic. But it failed, not by a large margin. And there was sort of an unspoken agreement at the time that they wouldn't try again. Like, the republic movement wouldn't try again until th the queen died, basically. That's not going to say that, you know, tomorrow, hey, hey, time to vote. It's just, uh... That's pretty much what, I guess, the agree the agreement was, more or less. Like, a gentleman's agreement. So, I mean, who knows? The thing is, there's not really much incentive to be part of the Commonwealth. It's not like how it used to be, where it would protect us from war, more or less. Uh... I guess. Monarchy? We're under a monarchy? Yeah. We're... We're part of the Commonwealth. The head of state is the Queen. And then we have a Prime Minister. Um, much like Canada. Canada's the same thing. Uh, that, right? Because that would destroy shots on melee. Don't get the eyeball pop, that's dumb. Hmm. I'm gonna open it in here. Nothing. Okay. It was cheap anyway. I probably should have yared that, it's okay. We'll see what happens. But if there is a vote, I would vote for a republic. Unless the unless the UK does something where, like, we have free travel, like the EU, where you don't need a passport to go to the UK, Canada, um, or any other country under the Commonwealth. I don't know. I don't really see a lot of point to it. Yeah. 
Yeah, Cat's right, like, in her younger years, she definitely did. I mean, she became queen in the middle of a war, if I'm not mistaken, which is kind of unprecedented. I think a free travel thing would be pretty sweet. It'd be cool to be able to go to Canada and the UK and just hop on a plane and not need a passport or anything. We can already do that with New Zealand. Like, visiting New Zealand is like visiting another state. Shit, dude. Slow and steady. Yeah, I don't know if I got this. The war to end all wars. No, I mean... I forgot who it was, but someone said that when they came up with the treaty that ended the First World War, that it was but a mere, like, uh, temporary thing. And that it would happen again. Not in those words, but you know. Yeah, I mean... I don't think any person in charge is gonna prevent that. Oh my god, fucking hell. Perseverance. This sucks. There's so many summons and I can't deal with it. Like, I'm being overrun by shit. Yeah. Not enough. <laughs> oh dear. I'm sorry. So, auto mod caught something. Cat wanted to say fucking Germans and it caught it. So then she permitted the term. Mm -hmm. I, can, I can see it in the moderator history. It says use slash add underscore permitted term fucking Germans. Oh, someone said it. Okay, I get it. Alright, fair enough. I should, uh... I should send that to my brother. <laughs> Just... To show his partner, it'd be funny. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. My bad. But we're talking specifically about, like, you know, Germans from that era, not present Germans. Yeah, we'll see what happens. I don't know. I can't expect they're gonna try and make Australia a republic for... I don't know. At least a year. <laughs> I think that would be the appropriate time to wait. It's not like they're gonna, they're gonna you know, the Prime Minister is gonna go on national television and say... You know, we stand together with Britain. We are sorry for the great loss you have experienced today. By the way, tomorrow we're going to have a referendum on leaving the Commonwealth. Okay, thanks. Bye. I am a very shiny skeleton. Do you know what they? Do you know what they did when we uh, had the original referendum? I was just a kid, right, and I didn't understand this. But what the monarchy did to kind of uh, try and shift things in the favor of staying with the Commonwealth, I think they sent Princess Diana here <laughs> on multiple trips because everyone was in love with her. So it was like a tactic or something. She visited here quite a bit during that era. I think next time they do the vote, it'll probably succeed as... I would imagine that's less 50-50 now. I think it's pretty much just boomers that would want to stay in it. I don't know. I can't imagine, like, an 18-year-old being that heavily into the monarchy. But hey, what do I know? This will probably be the last attempt I do at this. I've been trying and... <laughs> I just haven't had any success. Maybe I'm not in the right state of mind to do a bullet hell type thing right now. Uh... Okay, well, it doesn't affect that, so I don't care. Yeah. 
Wait, are they explosive immune? Jeez. <laughs> okay, no. I almost hit myself. Okay. Yeah, you know what? That would be a very good thing to happen. If I could get the transformation. I like playing this character, it's just bosses that have bullet health mechanics. <sighs> They're tricky. Or well, stuff like this. Skeleton heart! Basically, a HP up. Nice. Ugh. No. Oh, fuck. Uh, huh. Okay, not that I would use it with this, but. Okay. This could be good, because now I can maybe get a decent trinket. This, at the very least, will offer stats most of the time. I'm just thinking what I would even get. Or try to get. Oh, no. No. I hate this boss. I mean, Paralysis. I'm going to keep using it until I get something worthwhile. And then I'll stop using it and it'll just become a stat booster. Oh, nice. I reckon either the telescope lens or anything that affects fire, right? I mean, if I have that golf, I've clearly failed. <laughs> Thank you. 
Ah, uh, no. <laughs> Get that away from me, that's a horrible item. Uh, I guess that's not bad. It turns it into a heal. Every time I use it, which could be useful. It means it kills one full heart. There we go, fly into it. Okay. Teleport. Uh, I'm a bit adverse to this, but let's just see. It doesn't do anything to the bone, but then this becomes like this. Okay. As long as it doesn't affect the melee, I guess it's fine. item. Of course it's not worth it. <laughs> of course! Bag, uh, nah, keep going. Where is this? Just a trinket. Okay. Uh, hold two trinkets. That's probably a good idea. Assuming I can get the money. To justify this item a little more. Well, if I can get one more penny, then I can hold two. Oh, I can. 
There we go. Experimental pill. Okay. I'll make it this one. Nice. The problem is I don't really have damage, so... As good as this feels right now, it's just not gonna work against Hush. Uh, I gotta go back. The very least, get the half. There we go. Shit. This boss is horrible to fight. I hate this. <laughs> this boss is so annoying. It's super tanky as well. Okay, damage up, attack rate down. Okay, I'm alright with that. I guess I should see what it is. Yeah, it's not worth. Okay. Yep. <laughs> this is not this is not gonna win me any any runs, I don't think. Uh oh. <sighs> well, there goes that health I gained. What an obnoxious room. I'm excited. Yeah, okay. That, that kind of clinches us now. This random speed up is gonna fuck me over. Uh, yeah, that's nothing. I guess I gotta hope that this infinite loop trinket goes off. Okay. Uh, take the heart. There we go. Jeez, dude. <laughs> okay, take the heal.
Smelt- Oh, the smelter. That would have been good to take. I could have made those part of my being. I suppose I could still get it. It's not out of the question. I'm gonna look for it. Really? Is it? There it is. to get. <laughs> I don't know if that was worth it entirely. I suppose my ghost form got more health. That's something we definitely want. I might be able to get the smelter if I'm lucky. Oh, come on, two more pennies. One more penny. Really not gonna give it to me. Ah, oh, shit, the counterfeit penny was there. Lucky. <laughs> that was so lucky. I had to sacrifice... Um... Something to get it, but it's fine. I'll take these two as something to add. Okay. Smelt away. Part of my being. Oh my god, my movement speed! Ugh, the blue one is is annoying. Okay. 
Okay. Gotta hurry. Sure. Okay, I mean, that was alright. How are we doing? I always get this curse when I'm trying to make timing. These obnoxious rooms. Bump. Knockback? Yeah. I reckon knockback's a good one. <sighs> what an asshole of a game. Trying my hardest. Uh, that's probably not a good idea. Okay. Dead cat, not worth. All right. <sighs> well, I mean, health wise, I'm as healthy as I can be. It could be a little better. That's strength. All right, infestation shot. Which I guess is not bad. We do have three luck. Um. Yeah, this is good. I'm gonna go power instead of, uh... Instead of that. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god! Infinite loop, please! It procced. That was really lucky. A little more faith in this now. Oh, I can smack the balls away. What? Because of shielded contact? 
I'm deflecting. Yeah, dude. That was a little silly on my part, but whatever. The issue is still when things have a lot of minions. I guess I can use bombs for. I might have it this time. Okay, we'll let that go. The eyeballs are actually pretty useful in this circumstance. They are destroying the projectiles because they remain in the air and they linger. Fuck. Too late to react. Just go, 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 go. This fucking ice thing. Got it. Okay. Very good. Uh, more, uh, yeah, more iframes, definitely. Okay. Finally, success. Maybe. Could go either way. Okay, I did unlock something though. Guppy's collar. Eh, none of those. If it completed Guppy, I would take it, but it doesn't. Going. 
Oh, that double monster. Uh, it's getting more and more dire. I can't back out, can I? No. Nah. Interesting. I mean, more shots. And then these are now in a straight line, so... Oh, right. <laughs> Idiot. It's like an eye machine gun. I can do it. Super lucky with these. I don't know how much longer that luck will last. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. Swap. I think we're good either way. Thank you, extended iframes. No. Yes. <laughs> okay, got it. Excellent. All right, what does that leave on the forgotten? That just leaves the alternate path. All right, cool. Okay, this is where I am leaving Isaac. Good progress. I'm happy with that. Alright, uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna... I'm gonna go chill now. So, this was fun. Very happy with the progress I made. One more mark for the Forgotten and then it's done. <laughs>